Last week, my dad passed away in the fast lane on the New Jersey Turnpike. After the Mass, I feel it's only right I sit Shiva for him, like any good Catholic Jew would do. When preparing to sit Shiva, remove the couch cushions. Struck down by grief, the mortar should sit on a low stool or crate. This will actually be my dad's second Shiva. The story goes that my grandma sat Shiva for my dad while he was still alive. To her, my dad died when he married a Catholic girl from Guam. Cover the mirrors to encourage introspection. But now it's the real deal. Hi, I'm Jay. Uh huh. I live next door, and I, I want to let you know that I'm uh, sitting Shiva for my dad. Oh, good luck. I hope you win. I just sold a house. You need to decide. Hold Hi. on. Um, I live up the street, and I'm planning. I don't on... have any change. Wait. How does anyone make a friend here? I hear you, man. Hey, uh, you wouldn't want to come up and sit shiva with me for a bit, would you? Oh, man, I'd love to, but I'm allergic to cats. I don't have any cats. Fantastic. See you later. Thanks for being here. I know the first Shiva was too early, and this one's too late. Um, but uh, I just needed to do this for my dad. Sitting Shiva is a time to confront death. It is a great mitzvah for us to help you through this terrible, terrible chapter in your life. And now the yarmulkes. No, I have my own. Are you gonna pay us before the seven days or after? Uh. Now we perform the kriya, rending the garments. We tear our shirts so that we may create an opening to release the feelings of the heart. Baruch ata Adonai Eloheinu melech haolam layan ha emis. Shiva, day one. Is this a joke to you? Uh, no. I thought we talked about appropriate attire. I, I go straight to work after this. I'm afraid it's two strikes and you're out. Are you firing me? Maybe this was a bad idea. Day two. Ugh, terrible. We need at least eight more people. Well, can't you get your brother's computer club? What are we supposed to do? Not say Kaddish? Oops. Day three. I'd like her to be late. Tell me something about your dad. Uh, he was struck by lightning five times. Wow. He also loved to exaggerate. <laughs> you want to hear his voice? Yeah. Hi, Jay, it's Dad. Um, you wouldn't believe the ring we're getting. Uh, give me a ring, okay? Love you, Captain. Hi, Jay, it's Dad. Um, you wouldn't believe the ring we're getting. Uh, give me a ring, okay? Love you, Captain. Hi, Jay, it's Dad. Um, you wouldn't believe the ring we're getting. Uh, give me a ring, okay? Love you, Captain. Day four. <laughs> Day five. You should have called. I broke my arm on a trampoline. Yeah, life just charges ahead, doesn't it? Anyway, I can't stay. What do you mean? I talked to my mom about you, and she says it's wrong to take your money. I don't have to pay you. Plus, she says you're not even Jewish. Does that matter? Yeah. What about my dad? Uh, I gotta go. Wait, answer the question. What about my dad? 
Hey, what about my dad? My dad's gone. You want to keep going? Oh, say shalom bim romav. Pu ya ase shalom alenu. Vakol Yisrael vimru. Amen. Amen. Day six. Thanks for sticking it out with me. I just lost my wife. We're going to be okay. Will you be my grandpa? No. But I'll, I'll come back and, and say hi. That'd be nice. Seven. Mm -hmm.